guys. So we were asked not to take pictures and make videos with our phone and I just have to upload pictures of myself. I participated in almost everything. So it was final parade and parade competition. That's a summary of all the evening parade we've been having. So evening was meant for shisha event, for drama and dance competition. But here is my plateau dance presentation. to camp we were told that we can use jean and crested vest for carnival but in our time everything turned around to be different you understand but see but see stream one it's some hard though with different rules and the rest imagine they said we shouldn't use jeans we shouldn't use anything jean not even bomb shots not even shirts not even rig wear anything jean we shouldn't use it for carnival so we have the option of using traditional attire come with white on white that's why we are dressed this way we are on our white on white we don't have traditional attire but all the same shy your baby girl still have to look good so i tried putting on a red lipstick today and i packed my hair no wearing of cap i've been wearing cap for some weeks now no wearing of cap so my hair is still fine and it's a sunny day i have to use my glasses so I have to come out early so I'll be able to record everything. The sewing machine you've seen, the bucket and other stuff here are for the competition. The mannequin is for hair competition, buckets for soap making competition, machine for sewing competition. So each plateau was given a canopy. You are Mr. Plateau, and we are representing our dance from Anambra State, which is Amoki Dance. This is the first time we are to the stage. It's coming in and we are all veggies, the calabash on their chest. Hey! This is my begging rubbish.
working on the farm produce. They are doing harvesting and they are, that's their major occupation.